So, I don't know if you guys have heard about this, but there's a small game called Minecraft. And uh, they, do, they do this thing every year since 2017 where they have the players vote for a new thing in the game. Well, now, after almost six years, now people are tired of it. And they're like, you know what? Down with Mojang. So they made communist posters. Have you guys seen those? I mean, oh, yes. Let's go. Wait, yeah. Have you actually not seen them yet? I know Pan has. No, I haven't. Go, go on Twitter and just search, uh, hash, like, stop the Minecraft or stop the mob vote or something. Like, just go on Twitter for, like, two seconds and, like, look at Minecraft and you'll just see communist Minecraft posters. I've seen a couple of them. They're pretty fun. Why are people making communist revolution stop posters over the Minecraft mob vote? Because down with the Minecraft oh mob vote. Guys, it's not the fatherland, it's the motherland. Uh, that's what we're talking about today. Um, so I guess let's just get started. Uh, first off, I think some clarification for the three people that don't know what the mob vote is. So, like I said, ever since 2017, Mojang has held a mob vote for players to pick either a biome or a new mob to add into Minecraft. They give us three options every single year. Every single year, all the options have been cool, and every single year we have gone with the bullcrap and said, you know what, this is fine. Let's just destroy two other mobs forever. Now, Why not add all three? Yeah. Now, I think Mojang has once said, oh, eventually they'll be added. And they're not technically wrong, because the swamp did not win the biome vote, and yet the mangrove trees and the frogs ended up being in Minecraft, like it was shown in that vote. Um, why do I know this? Don't ask. But yeah, so far they have not shown any want to add anything from past votes besides that. Which, it's kind of annoying, because I don't know if Mojang realizes this, but the Minecraft player base is kind of stupid sometimes. One time, didn't Dream say to vote for a certain mob, and, like, everyone voted for that mob, and it won? Yeah. I don't remember which one it was, but... You seriously not? It was one. No, I don't remember, because I don't care. It's the I mean, I know I they, they, they definitely, uh, they purposefully showed more of some mobs and others make it more appealing, you know? Like, it was definitely rigged, yeah, no, for but, sure, like... For sure. It was rigged sometimes, I think. Like, I think the past uh, couple times, like, uh, shoot, what is it? With the LA, I think the fact that they just now changed, like, they just then changed the Vex model to match with the style of the LA, I think that that was kind of, it was either a giant coincidence or they were hoping that the LA would win so that way they could do that. And as far yeah. as the sniffer goes, I think it's just kind of obvious why Mojang wanted that to win. And I don't think that they're I mean, rigging it. I think that they're just... Uh, like, they just choose one that they would prefer to win. And just, like, are kind of like, yeah, this is this, and they're just like, yeah, this is definitely the best mob, so let's hope that that wins, because if not, then the update won't make total, like, complete sense. It feels like they're making some mobs better than others intentionally to rig it. Yeah. Because oh, yeah, the sure. ping one exists... People love the penguin. It is the stupidest thing that people well, are like. Well, it's a penguin. People are going to be over here simping for it. Yeah, but, but it's not a good mob. It do, it makes boats faster. I'm sorry, but if I'm going flow. to vote, I'm not voting for something that makes my boat faster, which is already a fast mode of transportation. You guys, yeah. guys, I got this revolutionary idea. Blue ice. It's honestly crazy. Yeah. I mean, I still think that the armadillo is the best, but I think if I'm just going to go with what majority says, I'm okay with the crab. But I still think I do not care. Just don't give me the penguin. If we get the penguin, I'm going to be angry. We're not going to get the penguin. The penguin's lost like every single uh, poll on Twitter. I think a lot of the controversy, though, is kind of sparking less from the mob boat as like it is, but I think a lot of it's coming less from the mob boat and more from Mojang themselves about how stupid their responses have been. Because they finally decided to, you know, defend themselves. And they were like, guys, 
guys, you got to stop harassing us. Which, it, like, to be completely fair, I do not condone harassing people. I'm just going to say it, though. I don't think it's... I don't know behind the scenes, but I don't think harassing is uh, what this should be called. It's more of, hey, we're tired of you guys running your game in a dumb way that we don't like. Maybe stop doing that. But I don't know the full story here. But Mojang basically said that the reason why they're not going to add, or why they can't just add all three, is because Java's really difficult to code on. From what I've heard, that's not very true. But you yeah, know, I haven't well, actually used Java, so no, no, no. I'm, I'm, cer I'm certain, like, I'm certain that Java is a, it's an old coding software. I'm certain that it's pretty difficult to use. Uh, here's well, what annoys modders can make the mod, like mods yeah, of that. The mobs. That. Pretty easily, then. That. And I saw a video uh, that was, oh, well, they have to build off that code, which they have to make sure that, that doesn't break that code. So do the modders! Like, I mean, a little bit less, but the modders have to make sure that nothing else in the game breaks because of their code. Yeah. What annoys me about this is that only now they've decided to say something. Like, they weren't saying something a while ago when people were like, hey, why are we getting less updates? They weren't saying... It's because Java's really hard to code on, and uh, it just takes... No, I wasn't time. around when... Wasn't there a time where they'd get, like, week... Minecraft would get, like, weekly updates? Oh, no. Yeah, there was. Not well, weekly, not weekly like, but... Maybe, like, every couple months. But it was not weekly. But um, it was definitely decently, uh... It was more than it one year. It was definitely year. faster, so... Yeah, one a year, and the updates have never been good. Like, let's let's think about it. How many times have you guys seen one of those, like, ancient uh, ruin things? Not, like, the ocean ones, but, like, the things from Trails and Tales. How many times have you guys seen that? Barely ever. I saw it once in a uh, SMP that somebody and I are on. Once. One once. time, never again. How many times have you guys found a sniffer egg? Never. Never, yeah. I haven't played Minecraft that much, so honestly, I, I haven't really had a chance to even look for them. Well, it's it's just that like they add so little stuff, and then we're just supposed to be completely okay with it. But honestly, I think if the, it, the timing wasn't this coincidental, if they were not so like, it's just oh this year that everyone's mad at them. Oh now now they're like guys, this is really difficult. Like I think that's what annoys me the most is that only now they're saying stuff about it, which yeah. to me just kind of feels like oh they just want people off their backs. I mean, yeah, harassment isn't exactly fun. No, but also, hey, maybe listen to the fandom and you're going to stop getting harassed. Yeah, listen to the people who you're trying I to... I listen to people. This is 2023. Fandom. No one listens to anyone. That's a pretty big problem. Well, I also feel like this should kind of finally be Mojang's sign to stop the mob vote. Because this is the first year that I think most, like, at least 75% of the community has agreed all mobs are pretty good. Like, all past years, people have been like, yeah, no, some of these are just stupid. Why would we ever need these? But this is, like, the first year that everyone's been like, actually, uh, yeah, that's pretty good. We, we should, yeah, we need that. Like, this is the first year. This has never happened before, as far as I can tell. And quite honestly, if you're going to do a vote, do, like, a block vote or something. Like, why does it have to be something so, like, like influential in Minecraft? Vote, you as... know? No, they did the biome vote, and they kept on telling us that they were going to add cool stuff, and then it would just be the same thing. Like, if you go back to the past biome votes, they were going to update the Savannah, and they were going to make it actually good. The like, Savannah look... actually... Mm -hmm. you... That's crazy, man. Like, they were going to add a new tree to that, two new mobs, technically, with that. Like, it would have been awesome, and uh, now the Savannah still sucks. Uh, so, Mojang, if we don't get the Savannah update soon, I'm going to be very disappointed. But, anyway, but <laughs> let's be honest, <laughs> they disappoint me anyways. So, um, it, it's just, it's just, I feel like it's more frustrating that they're not listening, and they're just continuing to be like, Hey guys, you gotta stop. We're we're doing the best that we can. When no, you're not. No, you're not. You're telling me yeah, that the massive, the multi-million dollar company with a massive team is doing worse than modders with like maybe one or three people. Like well, that's where things get one. stupid. Yeah. Like 
And I'm not going to use uh, examples like the Create mod, because uh, those have hundreds of people working on them. Yeah, but, like, uh, you know the person who made the Ether mod? That, uh, you know, that really old one. Uh, yeah. Didn't he respond to yeah. that stuff? Yeah, no. He apparently works at Mojang now. He's so, been working at Mojang. Yeah, yeah, he responded to the controversy, and he was like, guys, this guy's job is really hard to use, and I was like, isn't your job kind of revolving around programming with Java? Yeah. Like, I'm sorry, how'd you get a job at Mojang if you can't program well with Java? I mean, let's be honest. If you know programming, you're not over here knowing every line. You're over here casually looking everything up most of the time, especially young developers. Yeah, but this is their guys. This is their job. Yeah, they don't have to know every line of code, but they should at least know how to program. Pretty um, like, they should at least know eighty oh, percent of what that. they're coding. Even people with yeah. that kind of job, I'm just saying, looks stuff up a lot. And nobody can um, roll it perfectly, but like, no, but they should. They know can still do better. Yeah. yeah. They'd st- Still wouldn't really say it's hard necessarily, just that it's a little confusing. Would probably be the better term. I just think that their reasoning's dumb. Like, I just think that they're giving bad reasoning, which is just making people more mad. One more thing, and this goes back to, oh, Java's hard to code on. And I know that this is, like, maybe probably their last resort, because this would take forever. But move Minecraft to a different coding software. Like I'm aware yeah, no. how That's long that would take. No. I'm I'm aware. Yeah. Let me let me talk. I'm aware how long that would take, and how much effort that would take. But if it means that you are able to crank out updates more often, if you're able to give the the players more stuff that they will like faster, then I honestly think that it'd be worth it. Would have, that be is to have like canceling all team. those updates forever, like the console versions, and like switching over to like something like Bedrock. Honestly, if they just made Bedrock a bit more like Java, like if they just made it more like stable, I'd be fine with with Bedrock being the main thing. If they just made it as good as Java as far as uh, like uh, processing stuff, like I'd be fine with it. It's just the fact that it's so underpowered compared to Java. But uh, what are your guys' thoughts on everything? I mean, they definitely wouldn't. Personally, I don't think moving from Java is a good choice because, like, it gives it a certain it gives a certain feel to it. It could be recreated in other engines, but like, uh, it would it break a ton of mods, and people would probably be pretty mad about it too. So, pretty much all mods for Java would have to be remade, and that they'd just have to, would... they'd have to learn a new software. Someone would have to take up the role of leading it because. Knowing two programming languages is extremely difficult. Yeah. I, think, I really think the mob boat would be fine if they were actually going to add stuff from previous boats. Yeah. But so far, we have no evidence that they'd be doing that. So really, we're just killing two mobs that could be really fun additions to the game. And I'm going to be completely honest. It is a complete possibility that this year is finally the year that they add all the stuff. It is definitely a possibility that they finally do it. I doubt it. Not really. I mean, more than likely, they wouldn't. Yeah, because job is too hard to code with me. It's my job, but I don't really do it. Adding two pixels is so hard. No, but no, it wasn't. It wasn't too hard. It was unrealistic. Um, there's also a zombie in the game. I don't. The dragon in the corner. The wither in the corner. The walking. Flesh. The, the walking corpse of a dead man. Minecraft Steve holding 50 corpses. million netherite blocks. Yeah. Minecraft Steve holding more gold than seven Earths combined in a singular hand. Yeah, and I, I don't ever want to hear that it's Microsoft's fault for this. Because I know people like to use that excuse a lot. They're like, oh no, no, it's Microsoft's fault that Mojang sucks now. No. I mean, part of it probably is. No. Tell me what Microsoft has done that has ruined Mojang. Well, that's the problem, is that we can't really know that. Well, sure we could. They'd probably tell us because of the Microsoft thing. You can maybe 
say the Eula changing has kind of ruined mo like the Minecraft as a whole. They would not I don't tell think you. So. That'd probably break some NDA or some stupid legal stuff, but I don't know. I think on the mob vote though, it's I don't think it's Microsoft's fault. That's yeah, a mojang. Thing. It's completely a mojang thing. Like, again, I think it'd be fine if they just had plans of adding them, but so far we have no proof of that that they do. And maybe they do. Maybe they do, and they're just like kind of just lying to us all right now, and they're just like. Yeah, no, guys, stop being so mad at us. And then they're, like, cackling in the corner. They're like, yeah, they have no clue. We're going to add it anyways. <laughs> and, like, they just have no clue. But I doubt it. Because that's just, like, the best thing that they could do. Yeah, I I'm more just scared for this year's Minecraft Live. Because I feel like everyone just wants stuff to happen that's not going to happen. And then it's just going to result in everyone being super ticked off. Which, they're already mad. At this point, Mojang's just adding flames to the fire. I don't even think that's how that phrase goes. Um, so, what are your full thoughts on the game? Or not on the game. On the situation. Full thoughts. Um, Mojang well, I haven't paid much better. attention to it, but could have been Mojang handled way better. Mojang should do better. They need to do better. They need to do better if they don't want the game to start just completely failing. I More think than it already rate, is. Yeah, because I think at this rate, players are just getting fed up. All right, well, if you guys don't have any final thoughts, uh, that's going to be it. Yeah, I don't really have much to say on it. Just Mojang needs to do better. All right, well, with that, we will be back uh, hopefully next week. But considering the fact that we were supposed to be back next week three weeks ago, uh, wouldn't count on it. <laughs> uh, and we'll see you all... Uh, next time. Adios.